articulate the front end so it can lean into the turns like a two-wheeler. Yamaha now heads into uncharted waters with the innovative Nikon design that carries far more equipment up front than we are used to seeing, to say the very least. A short, wide fairing leads the way with a pair of LED headlights that come braced by LED markers DRLs beneath the spoiler brow that gives it a slightly pissed off visage. A stylishly cut vented windshield helps break the weather off the instruments for sure, but it probably does little to aid in rider comfort, in fact, I doubt it's even large enough to form an air pocket you can tuck into when you really want to get moving. Oh well, so what? A true bucket ain't, and there's nothing wrong with a bit of a or ride. The sides of the front fairing come with exaggerated cutouts that look much like wheel wells and fenders on a small automobile, no doubt necessary to make room for the major motion of the front end components. It's much wider up front than you would expect with a sport bike, or even a sport tourer, but falls more in line with non-sport type tour fairings, so while there are definitely some anomalous features to be found on the front end, it isn't entirely out of shape. Moving aft from the fairing the lines take on a much more recognizable shape with the typical fuel tank hump and chiseled seat that sports a slight rise to the pillion to form a dam to keep the rider's butt from sliding off the back. JC handles and flip-out passenger pegs finish up the pillion hardware, and the tail light comes incorporated with the tip of the tail with small standoff turn signals to complete the rear lighting. A combination hugger plate holder contains the spray from the rear wheel and keeps the rear end nice and clean, which is great, cause too many manufacturers make a nice looking bike, then ruin the look with the great big honkin' rear fender. All in all, it ain't a bad look, especially from the handlebars back. As for the front end, it works great, but it's going to take some getting used to the looks for sure.